Tanvi. I'm from Great Farewell. Today I'm going to speak about the topic a leader to drive beliefs. To become a good leader, as per my knowledge, you have to follow a few steps. The first one is self-respect as well as respect to others. The next one is redefining to win. The next one is Put the results in their place. Next one is select new heroes. Next, solve problems in the right steps. Going to food chain. Food chain always starts with a plant and ends with an animal. For example, if you take plant eaten by a caterpillar, caterpillar eaten by the frog. Now in this food chain, you can see that the plant is a producer and why is it a producer because it produces energy as well as it also produces food and next the plant is eaten by the caterpillar and the caterpillar is eaten by the frog next consumers consumers are the animals that do not produce energy or food there are three types of consumers, which are primary consumers, secondary consumers, tertiary consumers. Primary consumers, also known as herbivores, they are the animals who eat only plant food. And next, going to secondary, secondary consumers, also known as carnivores, are the animals who eat only animal food, also meat also. Yeah. So, yeah, tertiary consumers, tertiary consumers, also known as omnivores, those are the animals who eat both plant food as well as meat. Next, decomposers. When an animal dies, it dissolves into the soil. When that happens, the decomposers or the bacteria or the detectivores, they get all the nutrients from the animal skin and then they dissolve it and then they re release the nutrients and the nutrients are used by the plants. Next, food web. Food web is when a animal eats multiple of animals that is called a food web. And remember that humans are always omnivorous and they are at the end of any food chain. Species extinct effects on the environment. The biodiversity is very important to live happily on the earth. But nowadays, the species are disappearing permanently and this is affecting the environment as well as the ecosystem negatively. I could give a simple example that is the birds eat fruits. The, the birds dispose the seeds in another place and the plant grows and the seeds grows into a plant. They are saving the environment as well as they are making it uh, they are helping also the environment. But nowadays we are losing all the beauty because they are dying permanently or they are disappearing permanently. Now this is effect. So that's why we have to save, we have to save the environment as well as we have to at the same time we have to save the species and the animals. As a leader, what I am going to do is first I am going to learn how to save or protect the species and animals and wildlife. Next, I am going to I am going to keep my house as a wildlife friendly. Next, I am going to avoid harmful, harmful products or harmful food which harms the species and animals. I am going to avoid.
point at. And next, I'm going to visit many parks. Many parks to give shelter and give food 